The following are excerpts from RPN's interview of Neeraj Kanwar, Vice Chairman and Joint Managing Director of Apollo Tires at the 2008 iTech Show in Akron. Uh, just to give you an insight, we today are around $1.2 billion, $1.3 billion. Our target is to get to a $2 billion company by the year 2010. So I've got two more years to cover up this uh, remainder of the revenues on the sales side. Really, our greenfield projects are one in uh, in Chennai, in Tamil Nadu, which is becoming the mini Detroit of uh, India. All your car manufacturers are coming there. All your multinational global car manufacturers are setting up their plants in uh, that car, that part of the world. Uh, so Apollo, in its uh, strategy, has decided to put up a green field over there, really catering to two sides. One is the passenger segment, which is on the small cars. We needed to come out with a tire which would make profit at the end of the day. And then the second side is going to be our truck radial expansion program. We see India today is at around 8 to 10% uh, commercial segment is radialized. Um, in, in India. So catering, we being the market leaders in that commercial segment, we need to come out with a product suited for the Indian market. We already have a small pilot project running in our facility in Gujarat, but the product is doing excellent, uh, performance is doing very good, and therefore that's given us confidence to go ahead and put up a new radial truck radial bay in South India. As far as Apollo is concerned, we've been growing at a CAGR of around 18% over the past six years. We continue to be very strong. We continue to be pretty bullish on ourselves because we uh, today we the way we have set up our marketing distribution network in India is more exclusive networks, and uh, we believe that we have that captive audience and we have that uh, market accessibility where we are able to sell tires to our customers to address the customer needs to come out with the right specification tires for those customers and thereby giving growth to the organization. Europe is my focus area. Uh, the way Apollo has divided the whole world is uh, that India will look after the Asian Pacific continent, uh, South African plants should look after the African continent and South America, and Europe needs a facility to look after the European customers. We are planning to launch our products, um, the Apollo flagship products. Today we supply Regal products into the European market from South Africa. But we are planning to launch our Polo flagship products uh, sometime next year, early of next year. Given that situation, we are going to go into Eastern Europe. Where, I don't know. As I mentioned in my earlier uh, chat with you, hung Hungary was our... Um, we had listed, uh, we had narrowed down on Hungary as our location for our plant. But due to some political reasons, we are uh, back to square one. We are looking at pieces of land in... In, in Hungary and in Slovakia. And we'll be narrowing down on whatever site is suitable for Apollo. America is going to be my target after I am successful in Europe. I think it's a reality and we all have to live with it. Uh, the quality is much, much better and we should not underestimate um, the Chinese are, for that matter, the Indians, because the quality is is uh, going to be up, uh, is going to be good, it's going to be comparable.